How do you define success? My definition of success is across the board. If you're not ripped, if you're not rich, if you ain't rare, if you don't stand out, if you ain't across the board successful, it doesn't mean fucking shit to me. If you got straight tits and you're in your Rolls Royce, you look like a fucking clown to me. I'm just laughing at your dumb fucking ass. Okay. But this is the whole fucking point. You have a weakness. Change it, motherfucker. How the fuck? Are you going to lead people if you don't realize your weakness is their way out? They're not going to listen to you. You're sitting there possessing shit that they don't want to have. So, I mean, this is what people say. Oh, it's not about the money. It's about family, Wes. It's about this, about that. Motherfucker, when you're making money, it's about the money. When it's family, it's about family. When you're at the gym, it's about muscle. Whatever you're doing, it's about that. There's no black and white life. It's the gray area. You have to be good at everything. That's the goal, to really excel in every area. And that's the worst thing about these motherfuckers. They try to give you relationship advice. You got a borderline Miami 2. That's like a fucking Mississippi 6. Don't give me relationship advice to my 10 when you got a 2, motherfucker. Shut up. Boy, if you don't get... But this is this whole thing. People don't think I'm going to put the measuring stick to their motherfucking face. They better just... Watch what they say around a motherfucker who's beating them in every area. You better have a bad bitch. You better be ripped. You better fucking be rolling some sick shit. That's what I like. I, I grew up hussing. There has to be rims on my goddamn phantom. Go out front. That ain't, no, that ain't normal phantom. That's a mansory phantom. I don't have the normal shit. F*** that. Chicks got upgrades. Done. Well said, Wes. God damn. With the fire. The bullshit. There's nothing better to see somebody become a red pillar only to red pill more people in the red pill than they thought. I'm like, I need to have your money, your muscle, and a woman at your level and success. And if I don't have all of these things at the same time, I'm not successful because you got all of them. The f wrong with you? And I actually watched his content back in the day about to be strong, be consistent. The fact that he went so red pill, I started crying like Naruto. And if I become stronger, does that mean... I'll become as cold-hearted as you are! And whenever we have a drink, and they drink a little too much, oh man, I don't feel nothing. Everybody only like me for my money. I'm like, bro, that's what you promoted. My definition of success is having a family, having children, and being part of the apparatus of the world. And true wealth is a rejection of materialism. As Christ said himself, what good does it benefit a man? to gain the entire world at the cost of his soul. It's okay to have materialism. It's not against Christian ethics to become rich, become wealthy, but I just think it's all beside the point, ultimately. You're trying to go for a single thing, and it's to achieve something greater you have than money. the person. Does, does he have money? No. He, do you have money? No. No, I don't have money. How much money do you have? I don't have money. But, but here's the thing. Why is, why is money I'm a, valuable? I'm a, just, do you why, have money? What is money valuable for? I'm just asking. Do you have money? I just said no. I'm broke. I'm a nobody. No, but really, you are? Yeah. Is he really broke? Yeah. I'm just... Bro. <laughs> I just want to know. I have to know. No, I'm not, I'm not one of these rich guys. I don't have a Bugatti. I don't have a Lambo. I, don't I, have I a just Ferrari. really have to know. Like, how much money you got? Probably five, the five bucks in my pocket. Not much uh, more. See, does anyone, can anyone answer for the guy? <laughs> Why do they think I'm kidding? I have a family. I take care of an entire family. Uh, that's, that takes a lot He's of money. Right. He's doing all right. It's not that money is bad, but the thing is the moment you start to focus only on the money, I think it's distracting. But if you think you're better than other people, I'm like, it's delusional. Sometimes I wish you ran in the church and met Jesus. All I know is this. If you don't wake up, you're going to be very lonely when you're old. This is the thing, you guys. If you ain't fit, you can't say it's not all about being have being in good why, shape. Why not? If you don't have money, you can't say it's not all about money. Yeah, why not? But if he does have money, he can say that. Why not? He why can't. can't you say it? Why must you have the thing because you, because before I, you can, hang, on, hang on, hang on, let me ask the question. Because hypothetical is hypocritical. Let me ask the question. Hypothetical is hypocritical. How do you even know what I was going to say before I've even been allowed because to I ask the question? I know what you're going to say. Then what was I going to say? You're going to say, how, why can't you ask the question? Okay, so that's not what I was going to say. What I was going to say is how in the world can you create a standard that it's inappropriate to ask somebody how come if I don't have X thing, because I don't value X thing, does that mean X thing is actually valuable? You've never experienced it, so you can't speak about <laughs> you it. You think that I haven't experienced wealth? Even I, poor I people, was asking if you did. Even poor people experience days of wealth. I was they asking can, if you did. I, I don't people, know who you are. Even, yeah, but even poor people experience days of wealth. And so the thing is, is no, it's no, not, definitely not. Definitely yeah, not. Def, definitely, no, definitely so. Not. Definitely so. I know people that told me you only date the two ladies in your life. Why do you think you're more happy than me? And I'm like, well, I don't know. 
but the fact that I only have to try two and I know what I want, why would I choose a bunch like you when you're never happy? Slay! Definitely so. I've lived the lowest lows and the highest highs. Well, what's the, so what's the distinction? After you make X amount, hundreds of thousands of dollars, if you look at the studies done on this, it does not I don't hugely, fit no studies, It does not bro. hugely improve a person's are life. Are you proud of who the f*** you are? Why, why, why well, look you at, are you proud? If you look in the mirror, would you guys say this motherfucker's <laughs> proud of who the f*** he is? That's a bag of trash, dude. Pull your f***ing shirt because off I've been, and tell me you're f***ing proud because of Because I've been to f***ing prison? Jesus Christ, because look I've been at to you, prison? bro. You got 10-inch arms and tits. <laughs> Men don't have tits. No, guys. they go to prison. Get your ass hold beat on, on, in front of everybody. You think that that's better? Guys, you guys. think that that's okay. better? This guy is the perfect example how an overweight guy is telling me I'm going to live longer than you. What's wrong with you? You got 10-inch arms and tits. <laughs> Men don't have tits. No, guys. they go to prison. You're a demon. Get your ass beat in front of everybody. You think that's guys, better? Guys, you guys. think that that's okay. better? Let's let him give his his definition of success. And then having tits and ten inch arms is what a man is. Let's, you let, guys. Up, let's let him. Please get don't his... listen to that. The moment somebody gets a little pushback, and the first thing they want to do is insult your body, you're a weak man. Because the only way you can feel better about yourself is by degrading other people. Anyway, back to where I was at. Boobs. Yeah. Okay. Prison. But anyway, if you want. What? What? Yeah. If you want to follow the successful mantra of a man who tells you he's reformed from prison, understand why they might have gone there to begin with. And to take yes, care of I do. I'm just happy that he's trying to teach people how he got out. But the fact that you're going to degrade people to prove that, hey, I'm better, then maybe you're still a little in that prison. That's one thing we agree on. I do think that a rejection of materialism is something missing in society. And I do think that true wealth is the family. Being able to go home and look your family in the face and know that you're doing everything you can to support them. That's and then when you go to the beach is. with your family, they're like, there's my stud dad right there standing there. That went to prison, if you want to joke about it. Dad's a superhero. Look what he brought to the table. Look how hard this guy works. He came from sure. nothing to this. Yeah. He works very, he works, he's, God damn. You were going in the right direction, but then you had to be emotional again. You're reminding me of a certain group. Why would you say that? You're still whining. Stop whining that, that and just make an product. argument. I, dude, I'll smack your fat yeah, ass. So you're going to attack okay. You're going to attack All right, all right, all right. All right, all right. Dude, all right. Nobody's right. Do you usually attack this armed men in Florida? <laughs> you, dude. All right. He called. Look Let's at just... your goddamn self. Okay, guys, guys, I've guys, never guys, seen guys, such poo -poo. a pathetic mother. Okay, okay. well. Let's chill out a little I'll... bit, man, a little bit. This is not what men look like. Let's let them look at this point. Fucking shit. What do they look like? Bald prisoners? Is that what they look like? Th right, this is the problem up, in society. It's people like this think they can talk to someone like me like that. They really think they can. He, he knows he wouldn't do shit about it, and that's the problem. I mean, you're the one who got hostile for having a difference of opinion. Dude, tra check it out. You started coming at me about some other shit. Jesus yeah. Christ, men don't have this. We can agree on that. Physically. Men he, usually have he hair. Has, we can agree on that, too. He has Physically. crossed over... Gender barriers. I got all this and my family is happy with that. No child is happy with their father. They just buy them stuff to be happy. And if they are, maybe you're doing a very bad job. You're not contributing to a moral society and you're only contributing to a consumerist society, a materialistic society. That's the only thing you're going to worship. And tons of people worship material things and flash it around, but it's vacant. It's spiritually vacant. The craziest thing is... If you looked at the people who are supposedly materialistic, we've helped more people than these guys who. Why is helping? Be. What is? Why we've is helping? Wait, wait, wait. Why eyes. is helping important to you? I mean, because I know what it's like to be at the bottom. So okay. So, we, are you helping someone if you give them an expensive watch? Why do you think we just do that? You must not know who you're talking. I asked you to. a question. You didn't answer it. I give them the habits to build themselves. What did themselves. I ask you though? Said, am I helping them if I give them an expense watch? I give them habits, a mindset. So the I answer teach is no. To operate. So if you give no. them. Well, you guys are assuming we're only answer. doing no, no. stuff about materialism. Can a man answer a direct question? Not if he's that emotional. Mm -mm. <laughs> Bro, Hello. George Michael wants his pants back. Dude, <laughs> God damn. Look at whose shirt is that? Dude, that your, your fucking mom bought you that. Your aunt bought you that. For fucking Thanksgiving dinner. <laughs> That's like Oshkosh Bagosh or some shit, bro. <laughs> the most emotional person on that stage is the big guy that says he's the masculine man, that I need to be just like him. 
the thing about materialism. You're, you're, yeah, you he, worship it, guys, dude. You worship it. These guys must have grown up with money. The Bro, people you who worship didn't grow material. Up with money chase money. The worship materialism. Grow, you shut the f up. You, you don't worship know me, it. You I can tell. Lame. I can tell by your speaking. How the f do you think you listen? Know how me? reactive you are if someone Shave says your goddamn arm. See? Oh, you can't deal with it. You can't deal with it. Why would I shave my arms on the man? Look at these pale f oh, fuck is wrong with you? Okay. He keeps speaking, and I'm like, why would you even bring shaving your arm? Just shut up. I mean, I get his point, but he is so reactive. There are always consequences. My arms on the man. Look at these pale f oh, fuck is wrong with you? Okay. Shave your body. Aren't you a man? Look at this guy, dude. Okay, dude, let's dude, let Miguel finish this real dude, quick. Let's post these guys. Shave chicks. your pubes. Hey, post these guys' right, guys, women guys, back guys, here. Guys, 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 I want to see these guys', guys, guys women. Let's put guys, these trolls guys, back guys, here. Guys, guys, women guys, are not guys. objects hey, in our hey, world. Guys, we're not guys, 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 guys. Because it's the men that most men and women don't like. I've the, never heard more relax. lies than objects hey, in our hey, world. Guys, we're not guys, 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 relax. I've never heard more lies in my life. Relax. This is one thing I don't like. West, West, West. It's people who lie. You're crying. Let's, let's just no, move no, on. No, 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 no. We're gonna, We're gonna continue. Move on. I We're gonna make move you on. cry if you want. We're you gonna got. move on. We're gonna move on. We're gonna move on. I could if you want. We're gonna move on. That's all you got is threats. And We're gonna move strength. on, guys. We're gonna I'm move on. Speak. There are so many alpha men these days that make no sense how they preach, and it's a good message. But I don't think they treat the ladies well. If most men want a family, I'm not gonna talk about Again? this. Okay. And basically, you know what? <laughs> F you. Me? For bringing this up right here and right now. Me? Why? Why are you doing this to me? I didn't know that. I didn't know what it was. Well, just use a little bit of f***ing common sense. Sorry, apologies. Yeah. Fuck uh, you, f*** you. Elizabeth. Heartfelt. If your wife said that you could bring a smoking hot 22-year-old blonde over and y'all could both do it, would you do it? If he tells you no, he's a f***ing liar. Liar. Okay, I don't know, man. I mean, I will say that I I don't, I couldn't do it. I'm, I'm like one person. I just... I don't know. I, it, Look, it's man. Just, but I think that's how. But a bunch of people are wired different. You f losers that sit there and say, "Oh, it's getting rocky, Myron. You should leave. Why do you stay by Stinko? Do you stay by the Tate? But it's some bitch that makes the same allegations again." And I'm tired. I need to tell you people to like my video. Okay. Don't get me wrong. My boss a guitar bong. Put the fire na mi blonde kush hash purple skunk. Creo yo Colombici jam jam. Dur lo que ta verde ta welcome.